Hello students, today we will discuss classification of boiler or types of boiler. First classification is according to the axis of the boiler shell. Boilers are classified into vertical boiler, horizontal boiler and inclined boiler. If the axis of the boiler is vertical, then it is called vertical boiler. If the axis of the boiler is horizontal, then it is called horizontal boiler. It consumes more floor space. In case of inclined boiler, the axis is inclined. Next classification is according to the use of boilers. Boilers are classified into stationary boiler, portable boilers, locomotive boiler and marine boiler. First one is stationary boiler. These boilers are used for power plants. Next one is portable boilers. These are portable and are of small size used for temporary use at the sites. Next one is locomotive boiler. These are specially designed boilers to drive railway engines. Marine boilers are used on ships. Next classification is according to the relative passage of water and hot gases. Two types are there, fire tube and water tube. In fire tube boilers, the hot gases are inside the tubes and the water surrounds the tube. And in case of water tube boilers, the water is inside the tube and hot gases surround them. Next classification is according to the method of water circulation, natural circulation boiler and forced circulation boiler. If the circulation of water or steam is caused by the density difference. This density difference is due to the temperature variation. Then it is called natural circulation. In forced circulation, a water pump forces the water along its path. Next classification is according to the furnace position. Boilers are classified into externally fired and internally fired. If the furnace is outside the boiler unit, then it is called externally fired. And if the furnace is within the unit, then it is called internally fired. Next one is according to the pressure of the steam generated. Boilers are classified into low pressure boiler, medium pressure boiler, high pressure boiler, subcritical boiler and supercritical boiler. A boiler which produces steam at a pressure of 15 to 20 bar is called a low pressure boiler. This steam is used for process heating. In medium pressure boiler, the working pressure of steam ranges from 20 to 80 bars and is used for power generation or combined use of power generation and process heating. Next one is high pressure boiler. It produces steam at a pressure more than 80 bars. In case of subcritical boiler, boiler produces steam at a pressure less than the critical pressure. And supercritical boiler produces steam at a pressure greater than the critical pressure. Thank you.